inspire. Uh, what we're studying is what's important when it comes to Mutun al Almiya, Islamic text, is the text itself. Understanding the text. Sometimes people get carried away with explanation and reading explanation, but what you need to do is understand that the text is the objective and reading through the text and being familiar with the text and rereading the text and making maraja of the text that's what the objective is because the text in many of the ahadith are self-explanatory they explain themselves uh, just as a fa'ida or benefit uh, one of the points that Sheikh Uthaymin he mentions in the book when it comes down to certain words like al-muhabba he goes, Al-Muhabba in and of itself, is it explains itself and trying to give a shara or ta'rif of the word Muhabba, love, only increases it in ishkal and ghumud, which is, it makes it more obscure. When you say love, everyone understands what the word love means. But if someone says define love and you start to speak about it, it becomes more obscure. And that's the same with regards to uh, many of the ahadith that Imam Nawawi has put in this hadith in his collection, the hadith which the meaning is uh, clear and essential for every single Muslim, which is why it's one of the first books that the scholars of uh, the ulama and the scholars and the students of knowledge, they say for the student to study, uh, to memorize, to understand, and to make muraja'ah of. Naam.